Check out my brand new rainbow purse now available in the Roblox catalog. All of the links for this and all of my other merch can be found in the video description. Use star code Kristen when buying Robux or premium. Hey everyone, it's Kristen and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. So for today's video, you guys, we are once again back with a tour of the new Crooked Home. So this one I did a little bit differently, you guys, because it is actually a pet hotel. But I definitely wanted to keep with that new cat and dog aesthetic. So of course, before we jump into today's video, let me know in the comments, you guys, what have you been turning your Crooked Homes into? Have they been staying a home? or have you guys been turning them into something completely different so make sure to give today's video a very big thumbs up if you guys enjoy the tours and also make sure that you guys are subscribed with notifications on and let's go ahead you guys and just get started into it I do want to mention that there will be a speed build for this today on my other channel Kristen speed build so you guys can find a link for that in the description and I will be posting the complete speed build so if you guys do want to see how I created this you guys definitely make sure to check that out so oh my gosh I'm so excited <laughs> to show you guys so this took so long to do I'm just gonna put our cat over here this is actually the waiting room so you guys can see that the color scheme through the whole entire motel or the hotel is inspired by the cat wardrobe which is one of my favorite things <laughs> so it's pink and gray everywhere so this is actually where you can come and check in now this back wall you guys probably remember seeing that on the little mini town that we actually toured from mega sandwich i thought that was so adorable so i thought it would just work so perfectly here and there's also like food and water up here for your pets you're gonna see the posters over here so we did only have one that had the dog on it so you're gonna see like that poster everywhere and these new little tables are so stinking adorable but okay so I did shrink up this area a little bit as well just because it's the lobby and I did not want it to be like super duper ginormous let's pick you up and look you can eat just like that <laughs> the only place that you're gonna be able to actually put your cats on the counter <gasps> She looks so cute here. Okay, so downstairs, there's a couple different things. Also, you guys, I actually added brick on top of the stairs because I just thought that it gave it a little bit extra style. Like, I love these stairs. And it's actually super easy to do. You guys can see how I did that over on my other channel. But if we first come in here, this is actually the spa. So you guys know usually at hotels, they have like a spa, gym, massage area. So you can actually come over here and give your pets a little bit of a spot so those bowls you guys they're supposed to be bubbles <laughs> it's fine it's supposed to be bubbles and on top of the ceiling as you guys know one of the glitches in here is upstairs you cannot actually add anything onto the ceiling so we haven't we weren't able to bring that up here but I did add that over in these rooms over here so there's three different tubs for your pets because it is a hotel and there's three beds upstairs and then for um, all of your pets, it's on like bubbles, suds, and soap, the little paw print, and there is even over here like a little seating area. And even though that's a wardrobe, you guys, I'm just going to pretend that that's where we put like towels, stuff like that, and there's like literally bubbles everywhere. This is probably one of my favorite areas. Okay, we're going to need to... I'm gonna need to take her out. She is getting a little bit tired. It's fine. So over in here is actually where the bathroom is. I didn't want it to be over here in the spa. So I have it here and a change of clothes with some of those new posters. Then if we actually leave here, and I also made the ceilings a little bit slammed as well, slanted. And then, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. <laughs> so if we go upstairs, I did add a lot of, okay, are you hungry? Are you just, let's just put her over here for now. But I added a bunch of this decor, like all of these bricks and stuff to give it a little bit extra shape. And they actually had this window, I was going to say mirror, but they had this window here originally 
that I thought it just looked pretty cute. Like it's huge and it gives a little bit extra character over by the stairs. And then I just added in like this as well. And then the slanted ceiling and we need like food and water <laughs> for the cats. The posters are everywhere. And then a little seating area over here as well. So the first room that we are going to be checking out is what I picture to be the suite. Wait a minute. Are those different colors? Hang on. Let's do white and then white. Oh, it's just kind of glitchy. Okay, that's fine. Now, the unfortunate thing about when you are building up here is you are not actually able to add anything on the ceiling. So, it definitely was a little bit finicky, like adding this section here. I had to use like barriers that were stacked just so that it had something to stick on. So hopefully that is going to be something they will add because even if we're not able to glitch build, like it would be really cool if we were at least able to add like lights on the ceiling. And then of course we had the dog print on the back wall. And like I said, you guys, this is, oh, can we hang on? Let's go grab our cat. She is tired we're also gonna need to take her back down to the spot because she needs a bath you can come over here and the windows which are customized i just love this i didn't want it to be like too full of clutter because you, this is supposed to be like a hotel and hotels are super duper clean are you almost done oh my gosh we probably could have made her bed a little bit bigger but this one definitely fit and i love it it's super duper cozy i didn't actually add in any doors <laughs> I wish that Adopt Me would give us new doors that were not only like brown or black and brown. Like we need some that we can customize as well. Then if we go over into this room, we do have like another bed over here in the corner. Slanted walls, but this one has two double beds. So we're gonna just put you over here. So we have like the double bed over here, the little side table, and even that bed in the middle. Okay. She's not tired anymore, <laughs> but you can just go through and you guys I love 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 the layout of this I might even change it up to a home where I have like maybe a kitchen But I don't know I don't really want to lose the spa area and I actually really love how this hallway area turned out You guys can see because literally nothing was able to touch on the ceiling that is literally as high up as I was able to take that <laughs> But it's still super cute. Let's go over give our little cat there oh, she's so cute but there is the full tour of our brand new pet hotel in the new crooked home we have the entrance the little spa area and there's actually two bedrooms upstairs one with two beds one with one and of course if you guys do want to see the full speed build on how i built this check out my other channel kristen speed builds which you guys can find a link for that down in the description let me know what else you guys would like to see me build in the new crooked home and of course give today's video a very big thumbs up make sure that you guys are subscribed and hopefully i'm gonna get to see you all next time bye guys